Welcome to those of you streaming the action on CBS. No matter the stakes, no matter the records, throw out what you know. When Oklahoma and Oklahoma State meet, it's always bedlam. Let's take a look at the final numbers between these two. It took OT, but in the end, Boomer Sooner comes away with the 66 to 62 win. Uh, thrilling stuff here down the stretch, but it was the bearded one. Tanner Groves leading the way, 12 points, 10 rebounds, four assists for the senior forward who leads the Sooners to their 15th win of the season. For more, we welcome in CBS Sports Senior College Hoops writer Gary Parrish. GP, uh, you put it frankly here in the break as we were breaking this one down. Exciting stuff between two teams with little to play for beyond today. Obviously, you want to make a little noise in the Big 12 tournament if you are Oklahoma, but your headline from this one reads what? Um, listen, Oklahoma just needed a win. I mean, their at-large hopes are not very good, mm -hmm. but when you've still got, you know, some regular season games left and a conference tournament in a league like the Big 12, if you already get hot at the right time, you can start to accumulate quadrant one wins that might put you back in the at-large conversation. Um, more than anything, they needed a win, a win over anybody, uh, given that it was a rival, that makes it a little more special. They were the Sooners 2-11 and in their previous 13 games before this afternoon. So, uh, listen, Porter Mosier got off to a nice start in his first season in Oklahoma. It's been a rough stretch, but I'm sure he feels good about this one, even though they did squander a 14-point lead in regulation which forced them to have to win this game in overtime. Yeah, this is a program that did gain some national prominence over the last half decade. Here they are struggling, but a high point here on Saturday. Maybe it isn't the highest point of the season, and I lay that out to ask you this. How much noise can this Oklahoma team make Big 12 tournament time? Maybe there's not the depth in conference that we've seen in years of recent past, but OU, they got to pull off something special to get in the tournament. But short of that, how big of a thorn in someone's side could they be? Well, they, they could be a tough out for anybody because, you know, this is a team that ranks top 45 in the country in adjusted defensive efficiency, according to Ken Palm. So they're going to guard you. They guarded Oklahoma State pretty well in this game for maybe about 37 minutes and maybe not the last three minutes of regulation, which, again, is what forced this thing to go to an extra period. But, you know, anytime you've got some older guys, and they do, and you really guard, and they do, um, you know, you, you can be difficult um, in a 40-minute basketball game. Plus, Oklahoma has beaten good teams this season, so they're capable. They've just been, you know, in a really downward spiral for a, a significant period of time. But that says as much about the Big 12 as it says about them. If you take Oklahoma and put them in a different league, maybe literally any other league than the Big 12, they would not be 2-11 and 11 in their previous 13 games before today. The difficulty with playing in the Big 12 isn't that the top of the league is better than any other league. It's that the bottom of the league is better than any other league. And, you know, there are very few places you can go on the road um, if you aren't one of the best teams, like Kansas, Baylor, Texas Tech, and, and expect to win games. And, you know, when you're in the league like this, the number one league in the country, according to most of the computers, um, you know, they're, they're, it can really turn on you if, um, you know, you're not playing at a high level consistently and the losses can stack up. More than anything, that is what happened to Oklahoma this season. But again, you get in the Big 12 tournament. I don't want to say anything can happen, but, but lots of things can. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.